Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video I will show you how to update Windows 11 to version 22H2 on unsupported hardware i.e. Mabook Pro 2012. As you know Mabook Pro 2012 by default cannot be installed with Windows 11, because the processor does not support Windows 11 nor does it support TMP 2.0 and Secure Boot. So if you try to check Windows Update it won't be able to update to version 22H2. So we need to update manually via downloading the ISO Windows 11 22H2 first. Ok before starting this video I remind you don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Now open your favorite browser. Then go to google.com. In the google search box type windows 11. On the search results page click the download windows 11 link. On the Windows 11 page, scroll down to download Windows 11 ISO. Click select download and select Windows 11 Multi Edition ISO. Then click the download button. Then a menu appears to select the product language. Select the language you are using and then click the confirm button. Now click on 64-bit download button to start downloading Windows 11 ISO. And specify a folder location to save the Windows 11 ISO. The Windows 11 ISO download process is in progress and wait for the download process to complete. The Windows 11 ISO download process has been completed then click the show in folder icon. Then close your browser. Now click on system tray and then right click on bootcamp. Then select bootcamp control panel. On the startup disk select bootcamp. Then click the OK button to close the bootcamp control panel window. Now right click on Windows 11 ISO and select show more options. Then select extract to. Now open the extracted Windows 11 ISO folder. Then try running setup. Here click change how setup download update. Then select not right now. Then click the next button. Wait until the checking process is complete. As you can see, the current Mabook Pro does not meet the Windows 11 system requirements. Now click the close button to close the Windows 11 setup window. Now open sources folder. Scroll down until you find appraisers.dll. Then rename appraisers.dll.
After renaming appraisers.dll then click the back button. Now try to run setup again. Here click change how setup download update. Then select not right now. Then click the next button. As you can see, there is a notification that we are having trouble determining if your PC can run Windows 11. So we need to close this Windows 11 setup window. So we need to find a solution to bypass the limitations imposed by Microsoft. A few moments later. OK finally found a way to bypass the limitations of Windows 11. The solution is to copy appraisers.dll from Windows 10 ISO. So you need a Windows 10 ISO and if you don't have it please download the Windows 10 ISO first. Now open the Windows 10 ISO by double clicking it. Then open the sources folder. Scroll down until you find appraisers.dll. Then copy appraisers.dll. Now open the extracted Windows 11 ISO folder. Then open the sources folder. Now right click and select paste to paste appraisers.dll. As you can see appraisers.dll was created in 2021 as it is from Windows 10 ISO. Now we need to eject Windows 10 virtual drive to unmount Windows 10 ISO. Now open the extracted Windows 11 ISO folder. Then try running setup. Here click change how setup download update. Then select not right now. Then click the next button. Wait until the checking process is complete. As you can see, there are no more Windows 11 limitations from Microsoft. Now click the accept button. Here you are ready to install Windows 11. Click change what to keep if you need other settings. Because I just want to update to version 22H2 and don't want my personal files to be lost, so I choose keep personal files and apps. Then click the next button. Now click the install button to start the Windows 11 update. The Windows 11 installation process is in progress and wait for the installation process to complete. The installation process or rather the Windows 11 update has been completed. 
Now we need to check again in the system section to make sure Windows 11 22 H2 is installed. As you can see Windows 11 has been successfully updated to version 22 H2 on unsupported hardware. So that's it, if this video is useful don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you have any questions just comment down below. See you in the next video.